this illusion of stability in heart failure. But when you tell a stable heart failure, there is nothing like stable heart failure. Heart failure is never stable. At any, at any moment, they can be unstable. So 20% of the stable patients, where there is no prior heart failure hospitalization in a paradigm as had a primary event. Primary event means, here they decided, this is cardiovascular death or heart failure hospitalization. So stable, they were asymptomatic, 20% of patients, they had also seen uh, events. 17% died during the course of the trial, though we what we consider stable. Of stable patients who experienced a primary event, death preceded heart failure hospitalization 51%. 60% of these deaths were sudden cardiac death. So there is nothing like stable heart failure. So army should be started as early as possible. Do not wait till the deterioration of us. So it should be started as early as possible. This has been supported by the guidelines, the SEC, AHA, Heart Failure Society of America guidelines for the management of Heart Failure 2022. What they say? They are very clearly mentioned. You see, the first one, the class of recommendation, level of evidence. If in patients with heart failure with reduced digestion fraction, NYSA class 2 to 3, the use of RB is recommended to reduce the morbidity mortality. They tell army heart. Second, when the army is not feasible, when there is a reaction to army or if there is a not tolerating army, there is hypertension army, then only you can consider yes inhibitor. And third, in patients with the pre the army is not feasible and patient is intolerant to yes inhibitor, in those situations you go for ARB. So they are very clear. Heart will be previously what was there, either they were given AC not ARB with adequate dose, the patient tolerate, they are continuing, if patient do not tolerate, or patient still become unstable, or patient becomes heart failure increases, they were shifted to army. Now this is simple. You start with army, if army not feasible, go to AC neuter. If army and AC neuter not feasible, go to ARB. So use of AC or ARB only when RMD is not feasible. So in patients with previous or current symptoms of chronic heart failure with reduced disease infection in whom RMD is not feasible, treatment with AC or ARB provides high economic value.